Wow, that was hard. I never knew high-fiving was so violent and satisfying. My hand is a man now. Your hand is a bro. It is? Let's bro again. And first lady of the United States. Super Bowl Sunday. Before kickoff, we wanted to thank all the frontline healthcare heroes, both at the game and watching across the country. You put yourself at risk to keep the rest of us safe. God bless America. I don't know if you can hear it, but in the background, it sounds as if there is just nothing but booze going on. Now, I've seen counter arguments saying, oh, these aren't booze, X, Y, Z, but I mean, you tell me. You and your families carried us through this year with courage, compassion, and kindness. We couldn't have made it without you. With all our hearts. Notice how much talking she doing, first and foremost, like she, she, <laughs> she's the one that can definitely keep it together long enough to really uh, spew the rhetoric. Oh, the frontline workers and everything else like that. Yeah. How are those numbers are uh, panning out for us now? Huh? How are those numbers panning out? Because if you haven't noticed, there's been a sharp decline in amount of uh, of uh, situations with the with the beer bug, what not, what have you. But yeah, uh, man, I, this country, I, I, I love you. I love you all. Thank you and all of our essential workers. Let's remember, we all can do our part to save lives. Wear masks. Stay socially distanced. Get tested. Get so if you're wondering why there's so much, uh, I guess, tension with them throwing gates up around all different Capitol buildings and all this other stuff around D.C. right now, this is why. OK, like we're not I, I've said it a million times on this channel and I will say it again. I haven't said it a million times, but, you know, exaggerations. America is slow, not dumb. There's a big difference. <laughs> There's a big difference. And as much as they, you know, as much as the, the media and the, 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 the elected class, all of them, like each and everything from your mayor to your governor to your council rep, as much as all of them really want to live in their truth, right? They have their truth, but. I believe our side has the truth, right? And so thusly, the truth is a heist took place. We all know. And that's why you're getting booed right now. Make make no mistake about it. Like I said, we're not like we're not dumb. We really aren't. As a country, as a people, and I feel like I can speak for America in a lot of in a lot of ways because I've lived all over the nation. I've gone from California to New Jersey. I know the people of this country and slow, slow, but not stupid. Hear that sound clip, right? I mean, they like I can't help but feel like the whoever who was broadcasting. I'm not even sure. I didn't watch the Super Bowl. I stuck to that because, as I predicted, it was a bunch of just woke nonsense from all accounts that I'm getting outside of the game itself, which I, it was rather entertaining. Um, it was a lot of woke advertisements, and I wasn't I wasn't beat. I actually care a little bit more about the uh, lives that were lost during the summer of looting and rioting, which was used as an excuse for uh, Justice Roberts to, well, uh, allegedly was used as an excuse for Justice Roberts not to hear the, uh, to, 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 to withdraw the case uh, at the Supreme Court level before, you know, the, 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 the peaceful transition took place. So... Yeah, this is. Oh, oh let's uh, check out some of the players' reactions right quick. Yeah, uh, I'm just going. You know, saying like be be real quiet because everybody's saying it. you like you can still hear it. Like uh, <laughs> I'm telling you, folks ain't beat. They're really not beat for, for what took place 
over 2020. And I believe it's a good thing that the, um, that they're now drawing back the numbers and, you know, trying to do, doing what they can to, to, to ease on back out of it. But I mean, damage has been done and you have a lot of, uh, commentators such as your Tim pools and like, uh, sitting there talking about, Oh, this is an escalation and everything else like that. It, was it because for all those booze, right? Everything went off in Tampa really without a hitch. They, it, like yeah i'm pretty sure some people went to jail but <laughs> after Tampa wins the game you know there wasn't no mass fight or anything else like that it wasn't no big bro- brouhaha and that's because at the end of the day what makes us americans is a, is a certain set of values that really um you know what I'm saying outside that that really the only thing that supersedes like our shared values is the constitution <laughs> and the d- big difference between you know us Americans and new Americans and, and the like are that, you know, they do not respect nor really recognize the constitution when it's not in their favor. You see what I'm saying? So yeah, I, I really found this amazing. I love my country. I really do. Hold on. Let's, let's, let's listen one more time. I can't help but feel like this was a uh, teleprompter because he just, you know, it's Super Bowl Sunday. Okay. And now you speak. And now, you know, we'll give Biden his few lines. Yeah, scratch that. Put yourself at risk to keep the rest of us safe. You and your families carried us through this year with courage, compassion, and kindness. We couldn't have made it without you. No, no, no. It, from the sounds of it, you really did make it without us. <laughs> He really did. <laughs> Golly. It's so it's so disingenuous. It truly is, man. But notice the hand placement. Oh, putting her hand over her heart and doing all of the mannerisms to feign sincerity. It's pretty terrible. And it's it, we, it's been a year. It's been a year. America's never done this shit, but it's been a year. People are tired. People are so tired of it. All of it to get rid of one man. <sighs> Stay socially distanced. Get tested. Get vaccinated when it's your turn. And most of all, let's remember all those who we lost. So please join us. Kansas City Chiefs. Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Yeah, we're done here, guys. This is, uh, I feel it, like the, the booze really warm my cold, dead heart and lets me know that, you know, as a country, we'll be okay. We'll, we'll, we'll get it figured out. They're doing a ton of stuff at the state level right now, and uh, I might do uh, some videos on that coming up. But either ways, guys, with that being said, we're going to bring this to one to an end. All the internet stuff. If you like it, toss it. Like this, like, go ahead, do that too. Nobody's scared of you. Sub. If you enjoy my fantastic voice, you want to get videos like this every single day. Share, because sharing is caring. And YouTube and bitch, you don't like aren't the biggest fans of your boy over here for very obvious reasons. Bang the bell for notifications. Get something from the Teespring. Check me out on Patreon. Links in the description. Actually, go in there. Dis- demolish the description. and uh, Like, yeah, demolish all the links in the description and speak. Let me know. What do you guys think in the comments? Like, God. yeah, I, I, I love this country because at the end of the day, like I said, not dumb, just a little slow. But you may disagree, and that's what the comment section's for. Until the next one. Men, we don't know what we did.